Well, this might actually be a weekend that people want to see come to an end, at least when it comes to the weather. Temperatures have been hovering in the 40s and rain has been falling steadily. Today, the Twins played a doubleheader because yesterday's game was rained out. And as Susan Elizabeth Littlefield reports, despite the gray day, the Loyals showed up. Amidst the rain, amidst the gloom, the Minnesotan spirit shined through. Tough it out, that's why we came. Making the trip from central Minnesota, she's one of the loyal who braved the day at Target Field, employing their Minnesota survival techniques. Gotta just drink and keep staying warm. Internal warm. Internal warm, yes. We all had long sleeve shirts underneath and everything like that, so hopefully we can top it out. The clouds offered a silver lining. Since Saturday's game was canceled for rain, Sunday was a double header. Two for one? Yep, two for one. Always a bright side, even on a dark day. Well, you don't have to shovel rain. And uh, you got to put up a little wind, but that's uh, change of seasons is what Minnesota's all about. So you take the good with the bad, I guess. That's what Lynn Kelly had to remind Marv. I don't like it at all. He's visiting from Florida. If you come back, come back in August. <laughs> okay. I think we can guarantee some <laughs> warm weather. Hopefully. Maybe. Right? Yeah, yeah. No guarantees in this state. And certainly not in May when patios become barren and riverside strolls become uncomfortable. And then I stepped outside and it's this, so I just figured cut it short. Still try to get out here a little bit though. So your walk's almost over. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Sometimes in May in Minnesota, you cut your losses and press on, whether or not. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield, WCCO 4 News. Yeah, we're used to seeing lots of ups and downs during the month of May. Here.